Hello, and thank you for joining me on another one of my lifestyle series videos. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Dimitri, and I'm an American expat living in the Philippines. Here, I'm going to share with you how my life is going living in Metro Manila. If you find this video entertaining, please make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. And now, sit back, relax, and enjoy as I take in a journey of my daily life as a time-lapse traveler. That's one of the things that you will only find in the Philippines. Hello and welcome to a brand new Bolic Buy and Box video. So, this time, as I promised in my previous video, I actually did get <laughs> a box cutter. Actually, my mother-in-law got it for me, so it's perfect timing because I only received this a couple of days ago. And the box has just arrived. I've been looking forward to this one more than most because I know that there are some really nice goodies here in this box. Just in time for Christina's birthday, which is coming up in a couple of days. So let's get this bad boy opened up. This box, by the way, I should mention, is really the heaviest box that I've received so far. It seems like almost every box that I've been getting is heavier than the previous one. And this is not only not an exception, but this one is Wow, I can't even imagine how my mom was able to oh, package this together. Super heavy. But yeah, it's gonna be a lot easier for me to open it. Thanks to this box cutter. Thanks mom. Super helpful. Wow, look at that, just sliced open right away. I was having a hell of a time using scissors before. I want to make sure not to cut anything inside by accident. Wow, this is by far the easiest <laughs> experience ever. As you might know from my previous videos, my mom always does an extra good job at packaging these things. To start off with, there's some packing material, including, what is this? Looks like a sleeping bag. Okay, you know what? I'll leave that for later. Looks like, oh yeah, it's going all the way to the bottom it's like the cover also the floor cover wow what do we got here some frying pan and of course filled up inside there's a strainer oh, oops yeah it's it's not a barbie luckily <laughs> if it was a barbie i would have been very upset my wife in the background is having a jolly good time with the Barbie video. Okay, I don't know what this is for. I found the one my heart loves. Song of Solomon 3-4. That's nice, all right. Uh, looks like seeds for my father-in-law actually. Large leaf Italian basil and some other leaves inside here. Uh, this will be great for him to plant in Tai, tai. Yeah, these are all basil leaves. There's a farmhouse that we have in Tai, tai actually the place where my wife and I got married. Nice, so they're gonna be growing something else hopefully other than just uh, pineapples. What is this? Oh, honey. Oh, I love honey. It's really expensive to buy honey over here in the Philippines. It's a little cheaper in the US. My mom knows how much I love it, so she decided to send me over some. That was nice. What is this, a handkerchief? Okay, well, that's nice. Oops. Denied. Christmas style handkerchief. Ooh, this looks like a power bank. Yeah, oh, okay, that's nice. This is a really compact 10,000 milliamp power bank. Very cool. It's too bad that these things are still using a micro USB port to charge instead of a USB type C, but it's all good. And a convenient carrying case. All right, so I'll just get rid of that. Power bank will come in handy for sure. What else? Oh my God, blast from the past. Wow, wow, wee wow. My own personal CD player. Very nice. So, wow, this thing is old. It's a Panasonic Shockwave CD player. Let's see if there's anything inside here. Aw, it's empty. Too bad. I was using this when I was a kid. And before I even started college, there are two batteries that luckily doesn't look like they leaked. Oh, that's so cool. Batteries did not leak, so it's not damaged. My mom really should have taken this out though. I'll be testing this out later. Nice. This uh, CD player is actually uh, water resistant, which is kind of a rarity for the time. So that's cool. Talent LPM. Can't exactly get that around here, so that's nice. Some lip balm. Very funny how it's packaged, all right. Oh, we got a really cool mouse. Uh, I had a funky, weird issue with my mouse, so I figured that it would be a good time to, uh, to buy another one. Really nice mouse. What is this? Basil, I guess, huh? Mmm. 
still smells nice. Oh, and here's the cover for that frying pan. Pot, frying pan, whatever you call it. Some dry herb. Lavender, I think. Oh, yes. For anybody who hasn't seen my uh, buckwheat cooking video, I strongly recommend you check that video out. This is one of Maya and Christina's favorite foods, actually. It's a uh, perfect... Yeah, I am gonna say perfect. It's a really perfect uh, substitute for rice, which is a lot healthier uh, and goes with pretty much anything. Like whatever you would eat rice with, you can eat buckwheat with it. It's got a lot more nutritious value to it. I know that there's more where this came from. Got some shelled walnut, that's cool. Uh-oh, chocolate melted. Ay ay ay. There's a nice huge brick of dark chocolate in here, but it's really soft. Last time she sent it and it uh, came out fine, but oh, ay ay ay. Yeah, look what happened to it. It's all right. I'm sure it's still very much edible. Oh my God, it smells divine. Oh, I can't wait to sink my teeth into this. Dried pitted plums. All right, that's cool. Let's see, next we have, okay, <laughs> that's funny. Toothpicks with with tooth floss. I actually have something like this here already. Guess it wouldn't hurt some, to get some more. Oh yeah, hard drives. Thanks, Igor. Uh, my best friend, Igor. Uh, uh, wow, he's like a brother to me. He's been my best friend for actually about half my life already. Ooh, what is this, an SSD? Send this SSD, what's the capacity? 256, nice. 256 gigabyte solid state hard drive. Ultra thin, this is really, really thin. And some other hard drives. This is 160 gigs, definitely wouldn't hurt. But this one, this is a really nice surprise. Thanks, man. Definitely appreciate that. Ah, I think we have more hard drives here. Another hard drive, this is a SATA, 120 gigs. I've been getting a lot of messages from my sales ad that I made on, uh, on Facebook selling hard drives, so <laughs> no. At I have actually some positive responses for people. Oh, look at this. Mushrooms, dried mushrooms. We're gonna have some nice soup soon, huh? Rewind, 70s superheroes. Wow, this looks like a signed autograph. This looks like an original Arnold Schwarzenegger signed autograph. Okay, well, that's actually pretty cool. What is this? This looks like a school letter from, oh, Svidetevstvo Rajdenia. This is a birth certificate, a copy. This is my birth certificate. Oh my God, I've never seen this in my life. So yeah, I am a real person. I'm a real boy who was born in USSR on 27th of May, 1980. Hmm. All right, now I know. That's really nice. I had no idea this was coming, so this is a total surprise for me. There's also my mother's birth certificate from 1952. And we also have another surprise here. My father's diploma from 1975. That's really cool. His diploma as a civil engineer. The Kiev Institute of Civil Engineers. Nice, I've never seen this before in my life. This is the first time I'm laying my eyes on these things. Next, what do we have? Okay, now this is something that I've been really looking forward to. Perfect fit, look at this. Ta-da, Dell XPS. Thanks, Igor. This is a really nice present from my best friend Igor again. Dell XPS M1210. This is an oldie, but a goodie. It's got a, you know, still a decent dual core processor in here. Presumably a decent amount of RAM. And if I put one of those solid state hard drives in there, this will be actually quite a decent machine. Can't wait to see how this actually runs. Ooh, halva, nice. The halva that my mom sent me in the previous box is going to be running out soon, so this is really good. It's made out of um, sunflower seeds. Some more of the same. It's very popular in Russian stores all over New York. You can get it in, in just about any Russian deli. Oh yeah, these are two solid state hard drives that I bought. So wait a second, there were two. What is this? Okay, this is another one from Igor apparently. And this is a 320 gigabyte model SATA hard drive, so that's cool. These are more interesting. These are solid state hard drive. Uh, 256 gigabytes solid state and a 512 gigabyte SSD. Both of them are brand new. I just got them because they were like on a really nice sale. I'm pretty sure that I'll be able to find good use for them here. Some more basil, is it? Mm -hmm. This is mint. Sweetheart, there's some tea for you over here. Look at this. Yeah, you're gonna be drinking this tea for a while. What is this, more honey? I hope. Yes, raw honey together with a honeycomb. Oh, wow, that's so cool. Nice. What is this? Oh, I know what this is. Oh, nice. This is another self gift that I got for myself. How cool. Behold, an eight terabyte expansion drive. Beautiful, because my hard drive, my external hard drive, also eight terabytes, by the way, has been getting filled up. All my movie collections and uh, my videos that I've been making for YouTube. This will come in very handy. That's awesome. Oh, check it out, another frying pan, ceramic coating. This frying pan, uh, similar to the one that I got last time. We'll see what we're gonna do with this one. Uh, the ceramic coating over here makes it ideal for cooking pretty much anything without it getting stuck and also not getting burned. So you could pretty much just drop a, a fresh egg over here and fry the egg to perfection without really needing oil or anything. And it's not going to get stuck as long as the coating is new. Once it starts getting worn out and chipped a little bit, then 
a different story, but for a while, this frying pan is a miracle worker when it comes to making it a joy to cook. Oh my God, look at this amazing bowl over here. That's huge. I'm sure we're gonna find some good use for this. That's beautiful. It's a little glass mug, very nice. Beautiful, look at this one. Another one just like it. And what is this? Please be honey, please be honey. Yes, more honey. Dried fruit and nut mix. That's good, I love these mix. Chill mixes, shrink wrapped herbs. Bed sheet. This is so soft. Mm. Smells like mama's house. What? More chocolate. This one is not quite as melted. It's in better condition. More buckwheat. Told you there'd be more. And what is this? Woo. More honey with honeycomb. Awesome. Another glass mug. Whoa, that's huge. That's an amazing platter. Beautiful, this is gorgeous. Made in Italy. Oh, this is good. Ointment, it's made of papaya. It's really the best ointment you can possibly think of when it comes to healing wounds or scrapes or bruises or burns, things like that. Wow, this is really good. Melted a little bit, but I'm sure it's all right. Big container over here, what is this? Looks like a cookie jar. Oh, wow, I remember seeing this before. More glasses inside. And wow, look at this. That's beautiful. And, ah. Oh my God, this smells so amazing. I'm not even sure what kind of herbs are inside here. I'm gonna have to ask my mom later. This smells really awesome. Look how beautiful this cookie jar is. Ram chips for laptops. And it looks like a Wi-Fi card. Random size, wow, this is good. Mostly I see four gigabyte chips. That's awesome. Thanks, Igor. Some more toothpicks. Wow, nice big basin. Wow, more mushrooms. Mushroom blend, gourmet mushroom blend. We better be having some nice soups coming up. More mushrooms. Ah, wow, this is gonna be an amazing meal. Assortment of basins, bowls. They look like stainless steel, really good quality. This is so cool. And what do we have here? Don't tell me it's more mushrooms. Bag inside a bag inside a bag. Inside that, oh, seeds, a bunch of seeds. All this for my father-in-law. Very nice. Hopefully we'll be able to plant them soon. In fact, we're planning to go to Tegatai. And wait, there's still more. I got a bunch more actually. Look at this. All these assorted seeds. There's a zucchini, lima bean, watermelon, cucumber, bush bean, carrots, snow peas, more beans. That's a lot of seeds. Oh my God. Still more inside over here. Wow, beets. Different kind of beets. Huh? Tomatoes, peppers, more peppers. Wow. That ought to last a while. And guess what? More buckwheat. That's three now. What is this? Organic beetroot powder. Raw superfood. Nice. Oh man, this is so good. No way. Oh no. Oh my God. More seeds. Look at this. It's a lot of seeds. Uh, oh, this is uh, actually these are flowers. Marigold heirloom pine seeds. That's really cool. If it'll be possible to grow these pine trees, that would be really amazing. I don't know if the climate is right for that though. More buckwheat. That's four now. Parmigiano Regano. This is some fancy, fancy Italian cheese. Not from my mom. В этот раз она заклеила мешок, но я не вытянула воздух. Этот кусок нужно использовать первым. Right, I have to use this piece of cheese first. I'm just put it in the fridge for now. Next we got not buckwheat, but quinoa. It's another amazing superfood uh, that can also be used in lieu of rice or buckwheat. Not quite as healthy as buckwheat, but definitely up there. And it'll give some more variety to our diet. Very good stuff right here. And we keep going. More cheese, but this one is more properly sealed. Okay, mushroom powder. Yeah, my mom is really into mushrooms. That's cool, some snacks. Let me just show you what it looks like. Peanut butter chocolate chip, should be good. Oh my God, more cheese. What are we gonna do with all this cheese? Unbelievable. I guess I'm gonna have to make a lot of pasta. And we keep going. That's a big jar of something. What is this? Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Extra virgin olive oil, because here it's pretty expensive. My mom gets these for fairly decent price in New York. That'll be good for our salads. More buckwheat, that's five now. <laughs> so awesome. We might just have enough buckwheat to last until the next box comes, because we also have, check it out, more quinoa. Wow, wow, that's so cool. Five pounds, I think the other one is also about five pounds. So it's 10 pounds of quinoa and I think about five kilograms of buckwheat. Yeah, the storage bin that we use to store these things like rice and buckwheat and stuff, it's already filled up. More buckwheat, that's six. Yeah, we're gonna be good for quite a while. Ricky Martin, oh my God, this is actually my own CD. I think this is Igor's handwriting. 
Igor, is this your handwriting? Don't put this one on me. I might have had this disc, but it wasn't mine originally. More cheese. It's a lot of cheese. We're not really big cheese eaters, but this will have to be now. More mixed nuts. A wooden board. Nicely polished. Hopefully Chris has an idea what we're gonna do with this one. Next, what is this? A knife. Victoria Knox. Next we have a kitchen mat. Anti-slip. Some more CDs. Glenn Miller and Beethoven. Vivaldi, Master Series of Tchaikovsky, Jonathan Sebastian Bach, and some more Tchaikovsky. I remember this set, actually some really good music over here. Yeah, this is to use with a CD player. Hopefully I can get that one to work. A little jams, or is it more honey? Cherry jam, blackberry jam, more blackberry jam, some more mint, and looks like to round out what we have here is more shelled walnuts. So this box opening video finishes up with this nice soft sleeping bag that actually will come in handy in Taiga Tai. It's going to be really nice and comfortable to sleep on to be used kind of like as a mattress. So that's, uh, looks like that's it. Until the next box that I'm actually expecting to get pretty soon as well. My mom has been on a roll lately with uh, her packages. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do hit the like button. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Please take care of yourselves and each other. And as always, keep looking out for more videos coming at you from the Time Lapse Traveler. Bag inside a bag inside a bag.